Nelson Mandela once said, Education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. And I'm going to add some words here. English is the key which you can open the doors of unlimited knowledge. Hello everyone. It's again Improve Your Vocabulary video series and today we'll learn another group of words with the help of them you'll accelerate your fluency in English. Okay, let's start looking through the words which I have prepared for today's lesson and the first one is complexity. Complexity is a state of having lots of different parts and being difficult to understand, hard to find an answer. Example 1. Complexity of connections between neurons on human brain enables people to generate new ideas and find solutions for different problems. Okay, before saying that you cannot do something or an issue is so complicated and it's hard to solve the problem, remember the fact that you have the most powerful weapon in this universe. It's your brain and neurons in it. A human brain contains roughly 86 billion neurons, more than 100 trillion connections or synapses occur among them. So synapse means that connection between two neurons. So you can solve any arduous job, you are able to accomplish any hard work, no matter if it's mental or physical because you are gifted with the most miracles creation of the universe. There is no any impossible thing for you. You can achieve any high results you want, but those achievements should contribute to the development of society around you. Moreover, nature mustn't suffer from your revolutionary, innovative decisions. Okay, let's read the second example. Not all people can learn coding because of its complexity. Nowadays, lots of people are eager to learn coding and computer programming. But in reality, a few people have the relevant abilities, passions, and consistency to learn it because coding requires thinking logically, being patient and consistent until one finishes the learning process and achieves better results. Unfortunately, not all people have those qualities those who are more social and moving cannot go on till the end of coding courses and they give up in on halfway. As bonus vocabulary, you can learn antonyms of complexity, plainness, and simplicity. Next word on the list is bias. It's a little bit difficult to understand, thus listen to me carefully. Bias is the action of supporting or opposing a particular person or thing in an unfair way because allowing personal opinions to influence your judgment. First, look at the examples and I will give you a brief explanation after them. Example 1. People shouldn't have bias for political positions of governments. They must have fair attitude for conflicts, their reasons and results. Imagine you have been present the serious problem in your company and it's your and other workers' duty to find a solution. After a long research and hard work, you could manage to find a solution and perform it in a meeting with all managers, directors and your other co-workers. Unfortunately, the managers haven't agreed with you and your idea has been rejected and your co-workers are supporting the managers, although there is no any other bad choice and even some of them are opposing your words because they are afraid of losing positive attitude by the authority. They think that it influences their career negatively. Thus, they are supporting the managers, even if they know it's wrong. This is the bias that your co-workers have. Example 2. Cinderella always suffers from strong bias against her. Remember the tale about Cinderella. She was told of by others, even if she had done all the housework or hadn't done anything wrong. It was only because her stepmother and stepsisters didn't like her. They had hatred against Cinderella. In other words, 
they had strong bias against her. And the last word on the list is wield. Wield has two meanings. First one, to hold a weapon or tool and look as if you are going to use it. Example one, when you hear of Hollywood film about special agent 007, you always recall James Bond wielding a gun. Well, this young character in the second example is not as skilled as James Bond, but his fans, including me, think that he is more powerful than any special agent in the world. Harry Potter. Any warrior puts down their weapon when Harry Potter wields his magic wand. I assume those who have watched Harry Potter films or read books about him think alike. He is the best wizard. Let's turn to the second meaning of the word. So, wield is to have a lot of influence or power over other people. Example 1. Although Barack Obama finished his career as the president of the USA, he still wields enormous social influence among Americans. Example 2. The Queen of the UK doesn't wield real power in British government. Alright, we have finished another lesson. Now, I want to mention a quote by Aristotle. The roots of education are bitter, but the fruit is sweet. If you are working hard and spending lots of time, just remember one day all your hard work will pay off. Then, you'll be thankful for the days that you spend in pain of learning. Till next lesson, take care my friends, see ya!